Tisco, Tisco, Tisco. Tisco, 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 Tisco. Hi everyone, it's me Kiki here. Um, wait, actually, I need to get my coffee. Okay, now that we have the coffee, we can continue. Um, let me just put that there. Um, I hope the lighting is okay. I'm, I've changed spots. I am finally awake at a normal human time, which is why there's light. But I, in my house, like there's only one window. So natural light is very limited and yeah, so I'm trying this out. I hope it works out like fine that I can upload this because it's coming from this side and not like here. So I don't know if this will, this will work out, but I hope it does. And this is exactly why I'm filming this right now, even though I haven't gotten everything like ready for the binder um reorganization and stuff because i am actually up at a normal human time which is like half past 8 a.m i think i'm not sure what the time is i woke up at like 5 a.m today yeah but anyways let's get right into it i have this binder that i showcased in my like binder collection video as some of you may know and I use this as a binder for my freebies. But I have like a lot of smaller collections I wanted to start. I have started and I have. Um, so that's why I thought that maybe this would be a good binder for those collections. Because, well, a smaller binder for small collections does make sense. <laughs> More than a big binder for those. So... As my binder reorganization idea, I thought that I would put some of the collections here that I've just had, not like lying around, but in a big binder that I don't like the layout of. So I thought that maybe I should just switch them here and find another one for the freebies. So that's what we are doing today. Only this one, I will then add uh, me organizing the chief friend one since I got a... I ordered a bigger binder, like a thicker binder for the Chifrin collection, so it goes into one binder now, as well as my um, Vivis and the Chifrin solos have a new binder for them completely now, because I started collecting all the three Vivis, so it makes sense that they have their own binder because there's going to be a lot of PCs. But yeah, we will only be doing this one today, and I'll just add clips of me doing the other ones later on to this video. So they will all be in this one video, just not in this clip. But yeah, let's get started. We have... I'm gonna go in um, alphabetic order for the collections I'm putting here. So first of all, naturally, we have a BB because we don't have any A like anything that starts with A, so we will be using that. I'm kind of scared that this lighting like isn't good enough, but let's hope it is. Also, sorry for my nails. They're awful. Some of them are like long and some not. <laughs> but I didn't have time to do anything with them. But yeah, we have these BB cards. Um, and I did make fillers for the ones that we don't have. So I imagined it would go since I think which one of these were the I think these were the normal ones and these were the limited ones. So let's put these right here. And then the fillers I made. Yeah. What is it cut off here? I don't like that. I don't like that. Oh. It will be them. And then on the second page, we have the two limited ones. This lighting, am I on the way or something? Like, I don't like it. Like, 
like so and then this here's so oh I also I forgot I made the like dividers as well not for everyone because I ran out of paper but I did make these <laughs> DYI they look horrible especially from that but it works um so i don't really why did this keep coming off i don't really have anything like to put here because i don't want to waste um previous postcards so i may like have to um i may have to print out a photo of her to put here because i have some for the rest that i've done but not for her Let's continue. That's the baby one. This is what it looks like. And then you, my kind sir, cannot be here. Okay? Goodbye. And then next up we have the cream catcher. That's a D and we call it Gion. I mean well, if you have been here before, you know that I collected Gion and then I stopped. But it was never a decision I wanted to make. It was just one that I had to do because of I had to get my cat to the vet and I didn't have any money. So I had to sell her collection mainly. I didn't sell everything. I only sold like most of the album pieces I had. So I still have quite a lot of her cards. Especially because I had joined a like fan made PC um, thing that I didn't want to sell, and I don't know if those would even sell because they're fan made and not official. But I do have a lot of her cards still, and I just made another like wish list for her because I just kept feeling sad that I wasn't collecting her, so I made another wish list for her and i'm only collecting like cards i really like like my favorite cards from her there's like 15 or something like that so that i don't get overwhelmed with her collection and it's not like a big financial like commitment because i still like her cards a lot and i love her and i want to collect her so i made this decision and if you know me you know that this is not an easy one for me because i'm a completionist and i hate that nothing like i hate collecting only a half of pieces or something like that because i'm like that doesn't make sense why would you collect anything if you don't collect all of them and i'm trying to get rid of that toxic mindset <laughs> especially because i feel like a lot of people deal with that collecting community and literally your collection is fine if you are fine with it and you shouldn't like always think that everything needs to be complete and I think that's a real big issue. So I'm trying, like for me, <laughs> so I'm trying my best to just keep this collection to the, to the minimum, absolute minimum that I can. And if later I don't feel happy with it, I'll just collect more cards or then stop collecting her at all. But like, I am really trying here to make sure that I don't go overboard because I still really love her, but yeah. I don't know what I was thinking with the order. I had an order in mind. I think I'm gonna put the the, the, the these ones first. The season's greetings cards. These two, and then continue with the photo book cards. Put these go here. And then, because she has the same colored hair in the photo book photos, I thought I would put these here. Like so. And then I would put these next. Was there another one where there was? No, actually, I thought this way. Wait, what did I think? I think it was like this. 
and then this and this and then we would put these two because this is the same one but just a different version like so and that's all of the photo book cards then I was thinking of putting these these are the fan made sets that I was talking about I did give a few as a freebie so I don't have all of them anymore but let's just start putting them in we have these two cute selfie ones then we have the ones that she's holding the pen or whatever that is I don't know if it's a pen probably not um, then these almost close up like close up shots I guess so and then these two I did give the other one of these as a freebie but oh well that's just the perfect amount of cards to fill up two pages and then we have two of her album pieces that I kept to myself and I will expand on this later if I do get trades for the cards that I want to get I'm probably not buying any just because well I'm trying to restrict, <laughs> restrict my bu uh, buying so I will just probably trade for the cards I have on my wish list. Uh, feel free to check out if you have any of them and message me but yeah I will just expand on that then and I think do we have anything in between here oh 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 actually I missed a spot so what we're gonna do is just add these before her here no 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 let's not close that we have black paint <laughs> For here, I am still not happy that I stopped collecting them, but that was also needed for the vet visit, and I knew that these would sell well, so that's why I did that. But, but we have this many cards still left. I do have some up for sale and for trade still. These are the ones I want to absolutely keep, so. So let's just start with the album cards. This one is the first one. Uh, this, like, I'm trying to like keep this the same way as Gion, that like not stress about the amount of cards that I have, and just because I like Blackpink are my one of my alt of alt groups so it's not like i don't love them wait why did i do this i was supposed to do it like this what am i thinking like so mm, what i was saying was that black pink are my alt of alt hey, what the fuck am i doing <laughs> Um, I can't focus while I'm trying to speak, so I don't really like, I hate that, I, like, it feels weird that I'm not collecting them anymore, like, uh, as a full collection, but like, I don't want to give them up ever, so like, I just, like, not all, and this one is kind of what maybe probably changed my mind, about collecting, like how I got the courage to just collect a few of Gaion's cards as well, is the fact that um, I could keep my favorite cards from Blackpink and keep it as that and nothing else. I think that really, like I'm trying here because <laughs> I don't want to give them all away and 
I still don't want to like collect them anymore as much so that gave me like why don't you just keep the ones you have then like you don't have to have everything to be a fan or whatever and like yeah so I'm finally at a place mentally <laughs> where I can just keep these and call it a day um I'm still like not sure I really want to collect them in the future if I'm financially able to and I still like collecting because these days I feel like um, I'm not as fond of collecting as I was before and I hope it comes back because I really used to love it but now it's like sometimes it just gets to me like what am I doing and I don't know if this is a depressing subject but like I'm trying to be transparent sometimes I really do feel like I don't want to do something uh, collecting related anymore and this channel like obviously i really like doing videos for this channel so that keeps me like focused and happy with what i'm collecting but sometimes that's not enough and i just don't have the energy to do anything about my collections so i don't know i just i hope that it comes back and then i can start collecting blackpink fully again because they are my alt of alts group and i love chisoo and rose with all my heart and it just makes me sad that I had them almost complete and then I had to give that away but I have my favorites still and I that doesn't make me love them any less that I have these only so I'm trying to feel good about what I have left uh, these cards are not official, they're replicas by the way so <laughs> uh, my friend gave them to me because they were like 1 euro a whole set of 4 so I got these, and they got Jenny and uh, Lisa. But yeah, that was it. I think it's it's there. And then we jump back to Skyrim because we took a head start and put her there first. And then we come to a collection that I wanted to start since the beginning of time, um, but I just found it super hard. Like. To find anything so i was like well maybe i shouldn't start that because i'm just gonna be frustrated with how it's not going forwards but then i saw at facebook marketplace again that someone was selling some of the cards with the albums and i just had to jump on that because i haven't seen anyone sell them in like so long so i was like maybe i can finally jump start it and that is girls day they are also one of my alt of alt groups sadly they haven't released anything in a long while but i am super happy to let you know that i do have some of the cards i am collecting alt4 i love them all so much uh yura is my bias though but yeah so this one like starting this one makes me feel so good i finally got these pcs yesterday I was waiting to film this after I got these, but yeah, this is the one I'll be starting now. I will put it here. I don't have any, like, I have these fillers here, but I don't have the um, divider because I ran out of the paper and I don't have any notes because I ran out of notes as well. So I will just put them in here like so. This is their first era. Uh, and this like first era with photo cards ulti4 and this one will be in my bell so these cards let's put them in h order Harry is here mina is here and yura is here sadly i don't have swatching yet but Maybe someday, I really hope that this like jump starts my collection and I can actually finish it someday. It's gonna be hard, but maybe I'll find them at Mercury or something. Yes, and then we have searching for this one, the girls day every day. And this one is the concept one and this one I thought would be the selfie one. Music video outfits, like so. I really love this bag, like it's I love girls they like concepts. I just really love them. This back is so amazing. I really hope they release new music soon because I like I've been waiting for so long. 
and like they did say that they might so i got my hopes up i can't lie <laughs> so i'm waiting for that and maybe if they make like a special album like Kara made um i will be tuning in for sure so that's it for girls day we don't have any dividers for that and then we have it comes first then we have purple kiss and Irene, let's put this here. Um, did not feel good about stopping this collection either, and I have just started it again <laughs> because the new comeback looks absolutely amazing, and I just I can't. When I talked about this collection in the video before I stopped collecting, I was so happy with it, and I had every card uh, I had completed it almost, like not the. I didn't have all the nerdy cards, I had everything else and like it's so easy to collect purple keys I feel like and it's so fun because it's easy and it's like it brings you this sense of completion and like I don't know uh, and the pubs aren't like impossible to access either like they're easily accessible which makes it fun collecting those as well because i usually don't like collecting order benefits because i feel like it's just too hard and they are too expensive and everything but with purple kiss they're not they're really cheap usually uh, and there's so many like good and like nice group order managers that do sell them like super cheap as well and I just love joining Purple Kiss Ghosts. They're like, they usually always go well. Um, so I have decided to start Irie again because I the new concept just looks so amazing. I joined a go for that. And I'm trying to take it slow again. Last time I went super fast with it. I got it complete in like a month. Um, but this time I'm in no rush. I will just collect cards when I see them. If I have the money if I can trade for them. But yes, let's start this collection again, shall we? We have the fillers here for interviolet. When is that second one? There it is. What I don't like and I was like thinking about like why would I start again is that I did have everything and I gave them away and it just feels stupid to get them again but i'm trying to ignore that voice in my head because i just do love collecting the iri so much that it doesn't matter if i had them i can always get them again <laughs> i will put these fillers that my friend gave me here because they're just super cute and they fill up the page because into violet only has two cards then let's the hide and seek fillers um, I also wanted to put because last time I had Irie in the big binder I wanted to put her here because um, usually their uh, eras have four cards per album so it just fits in a A5 binder perfectly like so then we have the Memem era, which I have one card that I kept because it's like my favorite card, like the black cards on her cheeks. This is just so beautiful. Um, she's so cute, like I love her cards. She never misses with the selfish. So beautiful. Oh my god. Let's go in. Then we have, what do we have? Then we have Gigi Land. That's a POB. That's a POB. These are the actual album cards that I have left. These three, we have the photo book ones, and this is the Digi Bag, if I remember correctly. Um, so it's just these here like so and then take it back there 
this is like i had to keep this one as well i've kept all of these three but i had to keep this one because this is like my favorite um irish card ever like card ever i don't know it's just so cute then let's put pobs i have these two pobs that i kept from the ghost i joined i kept them because i love like cards like this with the back on there or like these finger hand thingies and really finger hand hand to heart thingies <laughs> they're just super cute then we have this it's me and my friend there um that's our biases <laughs> then i have these fillers that my friend gave me that are super pretty so i just love keeping them here to fill up pages as you know and i'm gonna put this like here maybe that looks fine right um should i put it like here actually i should probably put it here because she had black hair and lemon arrow that kind of fills the page um that's that for that then i have Fillers made for the. Let's put them in actually. The new era. I am not sure if I read correctly, but if I did, there is only four pieces again. Actually, there might be more because like there's the polka version and stuff. But I haven't checked that out yet. These are the photo book ones, I feel like. They have four. So they fill up a page nicely there. And this is what this looks like now. Wait, where did we start? Let's turn. I the thing I hate that these don't like stay in place in this binder. Yeah, that's that. Then we have my most very small TXT collection. Because if you remember, I collected Bongyu and Subin. Oh, wait. But I had to keep them up as well. Except I totally didn't with Bongyu. I couldn't let go of them. I still have a lot of his cards. I don't remember the order. I gave two away, I think. Like, traded two away. But... Other than that, I feel like I didn't really stop collecting him. I just haven't got any new cards, if that makes sense. Let's put the, how do we get this? Let's put this here. My absolute favorite souping card. <laughs> I can't like I gave all of my other souping cards away, but I could not give that. And I still will mourn the other cards. To this day, I am not over that I gave them away. I feel so bad. Like that's top ten worst mistakes of my whole life. I will be sad about that for the rest of it. But what's done is done. <laughs> and we have to move on. Actually, I did give a lot of bomb use cards away because I had the because I had the whole chaos chapter done. And now I have nothing except the fight or escape one. Oh no, I'm gonna be sad again. <laughs> then I had the full set of these except one PC. So I did give those two away as well. We have the tier one and the Sunara POB. That's that for Bungyu and Subin. <laughs> TXT. I really feel like I want to collect one card for each of them from the new era, so I'll have to see if I can find them somewhere easily. Um, yeah. And then, lastly but not least, we have my one page Yunhyuk collection <laughs> of my Mosaic units. They were my biases, and I. They were the only, only. They were the first people I actually collected, which 
aside from XG from the Blue Chasen. But yeah, I really don't miss collecting them. It was super like... I don't really miss collecting men. TXG don't count. But yeah, I these are some of the cards that I just like. They have value for me, like personal value. So I kept the units and I will be putting on my MISC the uh, wish list that I want to collect the ones from the newer album as well so I will just keep collecting their unit cards from one stacks and nothing else maybe one or two selfies at some point but yeah these are just the ones I want to keep so I will have them here at the end is this which way yeah like so this one is my like one of my top favorite cards ever I searched for it for years, like I could not find it anyway. But that's it for this one. This binder is now complete, or like I need to still find the dividers, but let's just flip through it. We have a baby, we have that thing. We have Gun, Dreamcatcher, we have Girls Day, we have the item, we have Cookies. And we have one set. And that is everything for this one. I will see you in the next clip. Hello everyone, it's me Kiki again. I this is the second part of my uh, binder reorganization video, a collection update, um, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> and now in this clip i will be actually if i have time i will probably go through every binder except the one we went through the in the last clip but if i have time if i don't then i'm just gonna be doing this one this is my a pink and red velvet binder and i will be organizing let's see if i need to do some organization for the a pink one I'm not entirely sure, but I something that I will do is the Irene portion. I will be changing the order of that one because, well, you'll just see what I mean. But uh, first of all, let's just look at the A pink one. <laughs> um, if I do remember correctly, I had an issue with one part of this, and it was the look and horn one. So I need to check if um if I've counted these correctly, if I have one. So let me just count that real quick. Okay, so I'm back. I have now calculated everything, like how many cards there is for me uh, per era that I need to be on the lookout for. How many cards there is per era, like so. So let's just get counting. Um, I have one for that, yeah. Secret Garden has two here, yeah. Pink Blossom, two. Pink Love, two. Pink Memory has four, so one, two, three, four. Yep. Um, Pink Revolution has two. Here has one. Pink Up has three. Miracle has two, one in six has four, percent has three, like so. And then Luke has, yeah, this is, yeah, Luke has four cards, and I took one out so that the, these outfits would be, because there's three cards with this outfit, if I remember correctly. So, did I have one space here? Yeah, I took one from here so that everything up until 
this moment would be like perfectly because then one era would be like one since deer only has one card it fits perfectly with the pink revolution that has two cards so that it wouldn't go into the next line but now i don't because i'm missing one look and i have spaces here i have multiple um ones that don't have anything i don't know what to do i was thinking like i could have feelers probably if i just started the horn era from a completely new page um or the copycat one since There is spaces for these. So what if I just, let's see what it looks like if I just take everything out, like I said. So we take all the horn ones, then we should have like the last look here. And then there's the space that I don't know what to do with. Um, hmm. Horn. How many cards does Horn have? It has three, six, seven, eight. If it has eight cards, what did I say? Yeah, Horn has eight cards, so I could like hit, I could fit them onto one page perfectly. Where can I get a page though? If I get rid of this one, the transparent set, because I don't really I don't really enjoy transparent ones anyways. So if I just take this set out and I can use these asphalt velvet fillers if I need those. So let's just put this here where it should start the other thing is though that um copycat has 20 photo cards so they don't like there's two that don't fit into any page no so, but that's another issue i will have to see after this it kind of looks a bit now because there's nothing in between look because there's gonna be one here so there's gonna be this whole four four five thing that has nothing but i'll just figure out something there i think i will like it more because one thing that i absolutely want is that all these three cards are here they can start this page actually let's um, put this here because I know there is three cards um, with these pink outfits. So that will then work perfect there. And I can put these here. Wait, no. Let's do this. Because there's eight cards, so. Now there's one spot that's empty, but we can just do this. And then this will commemorate the. I actually have this AR card on the way, so I feel like I don't need to do a. Put a note tape there, I will just remember it. But this is what I hate now because you can see through it. <laughs> um, I'll just put these here for now. I have more of the pink sleeves somewhere in here. But I am too lazy to move, so let's just put those there. So this is going to be... I will have to figure something out for here, but now I think it looks otherwise good. Because here we have everything perfectly here. Um, and then one, it would be this one page. And then 
well this is the next issue um if he hmm. yeah i have it like every normal album Choron card is here and then the platform ones are here or well, here or here and then the normal uh units are here but i because 20 is such a like such an annoying number because you have for the nine pocket page layout because two cards will be out for blood so if i just change these here I hate using fillers by the way like I, I just want to have um, the page full of album cards but I feel like because this layout I don't I don't know which other way it could work out that I will just have to put something here um yeah I don't think I can salvage this situation in any other way but we will just keep it like this. I will have to. Well, I have these white ones for now. But yeah, I don't. I don't like this at all. I don't know what to do with this, to be honest. Well, actually, now that I think about it, there's three uh, platform units, and then there's um, six units for this one. So I, what I might do is actually just put every unit on one page. I don't know why I didn't think of that before. Is it like that? It is, right? Yeah. So... to do with this one though we have um we have six, three platform selfies well not like selfies but cards and then we have eight ones six go there then two oh my god i hate it two get left out no matter what i do you know what? I might do something I've never done before and just say fuck it with the platforms and um, put them behind the first page um, of cards. Like, I don't have any examples for you, but I can just show you. Um, there is that one platform card that's like colorful and then the two are like the white background and the other one is the forest one this one with the black outfit um i might put the black one up behind here or like hmm, put the on this side the one that has the colorful one because it fits these two and then put like two of the other cards behind these ones um, I don't know if I will like it, but I will just take this out for now because, well, the platform ones aren't even my priority. I like these a lot more. So I'll just see if I even collect them. But for now, let's do this because it seriously irritates me so much to have like a few cards not on the same page as the others. And this would like perfectly have just two pages for the copycat one. So I think I might just do that. Um, but we will see. But this is what it looks like now. I think now we are finally at a place where it looks somewhat okay. Um, oh my god, my this binder is also breaking apart. This cannot be. I 
again this one no but um you will figure out something for it i hope hmm Let's see for that one. Then uh, we will get into Irene. Let me just take everything out first. Okay, everything regarding her is now out. Um, what I had planned for this um, collection was that since I had everything in chronological order before, I would like it a lot more if it was not in that order. But because it kind of looked messy in my opinion that it just switched from red velvet like group stuff to unit stuff and stuff like that. So I thought that maybe I should do it like a uh, project twice. Um, so every like red velvet like group card, um, I mean group comeback, OT5, uh, would be like all just after each other and then monster and smcu and stuff like these would be like after those so that's what i will be doing today the first steps should be the same though let me just find the first cards i did not do in this i did not do this in any normal order which i missed it before i think this is everything for the first page we have ice cream cake I will also update this, uh, all these binders as I'm reorganizing them if I have anything new for them. I do not remember if I had the second rookie Irene the last time I updated my binder. Pretty sure I did though, but if I didn't, then um, we have it now. If I did, then it's nothing new. Do have these two? There's some roll that goes between those two, though. This is not. Let's just put these in this order. Then we have the red summer. Oh, right here, I thought that I would put like a floor in between. Guess um, red summer only has two cards. I would like to fill a page again. So let's drop these monster ones there. And let's feel my rhythm. Then we have birthday. And day final. Day two. Queendom. Um, here's the filler, I suppose. Let's put that there. And now that we have our cute fillers, let's put Joy in here, just because we can. That is going to be our filler. <laughs> um, where is the summer doll? Oh, there it is. I'm just really blind. It was there the whole time. Jesus. Um, but yeah. Alright, I also didn't have the Japanese releases even though I wanted to collect them the whole time. I never had them on here. So now I will be changing that as well. Well there's an empty one. Did I just not have a thing for it? Maybe I didn't. It's going to be cookie jar. 
Then the next one is Summer Magic. We have this one here. Then we have the limited one. And then sadly, I have to do this for RBB, which I hate. We will move and put this here. And then the second one, in the first picture here. Sappy, I guess I don't have anything, but that will go here. Then we have day one. I actually have Scarf Irene on the way, which makes me super happy. Then we have day two. Oh, the reason why it took me so long is because I uh, there's four cards for the day, oh God, day two. But I'm still debating with myself if I want to, um, if I want the infamous Irene card with her shadow on it, because I'm not sure. I personally do not like cards like that because it doesn't even show the person that you are collecting, like fully. Um, but yeah, I'm a completionist, so if I get my hands on that, I guess I will, but I will not be paying big money for it or will be actively looking for it. It's just on my wish list, so I don't have a space for it for now. But if I do end up uh, wanting a space for it, then we have to organize everything again. But for now, I don't have it. Um, yeah. yeah. So that's that. And then we move on to final. Um, we have the, these ones. Let's just put them both here. normally go into the monster era with the way I had it before but now we will instead do Queendom Queendom has three cards so once again there will be a space for a filler now um, I will put just let's put Irene this time our Irene filler goes right there change it to pink because yeah but we do have these we have the girls one and you go in like so then we have this one so we're missing the latte one so that fills up that page nicely then we come in to feel my rhythm do have one card of the way. Finally, I have Princess Ringing coming. So that is exciting. And then we move on to Bloom goes there. So it has Bloom. And then we come into birthday, which has how many cards does this birthday have again? We have that photo book one. I actually, this one you guys did not see before. Um, we have this birthday Irene photo book version, super lovely. We put that there. I do have everything on the way except the. Just put this here. Cake version here. Wait, no, it's not perfect. I counted this as one. It is not perfect. 
um i maybe want to need to like i maybe need to find out pob for to fill that one but otherwise it's perfect so we will need to find a one pob for this one to fill that page right up and then we come into the extra things we have the SMCU here. No wait, I wanted the I wanted the monster error here. So we have the monster cards. Now would be a great time to remember T versions again. Hmm. I had that the backstone tell you which is which. Well, I'll be right back. I have refreshed my memory. This is how it goes. We have the top knot ones here. Let's put them in here. Which one is this meant to be this way? And then what I had envisioned for this one is that this would be a um, continuation. Like I'm not gonna put anything here. I'm not gonna continue SMCU in here. And this will be if she has her solo, it goes here. Or if Irene and Sulky have a comeback, that will fit in here perfectly. Um, so then for the next page, we're just gonna do the SMCU ones. Actually, let's do this is the second one. This is the first one. I have the ID for the first one on the way, and also the red velvet version on the way. So, hopefully, those come soon. It's been weeks. I'm getting kind of scared they got lost. We're staying with the birthday ones. Um, but let's hope that I don't lose every single Irene that I had on the way. That just possibly cannot happen. But, huh, I don't remember how this went. So I'll just, you know what? I'll just put them here in any order. And I will check that later because I've been doing too much running around trying to figure out these from my computer because my tablet broke <laughs> so i can't look at them right here but yeah that would be irene let me just show irene real quick i really like it i'm not sure with this yet but so far i think it's gonna look fine what i like the most is that day two Okay, no, actually I don't. Let's just forget that. And then we have two D5 sets here for the sister screenings and all the other stuff that I don't collect. Yeah, that was it for that. And then let's move on to WGSN. I think I have time for all of them today, actually. 
I took the liberty to take them out of here already, like just now. But what we'll do, we'll do. Hello. Uh, I got a new binder, the bigger binder, as you can see. In got nothing in this one. This one has nothing in this one. I meant um, a big ass binder for my WJSM collection because it's getting quite big. Um, so let's just first of all change everything here. I don't actually. I will just update my binder with the WJSM collection. I'm not changing the order of anything. I think. So let's just change the collection to the bigger binder and then look at the new cards I have. So, I actually made a divider as well and uh, this, but I hate both. I don't really like either. So I don't know what to do with them. We will see. But goodbye, broken binder. Sorry if the lighting's changed, I had to take a break because I started feeling really nauseous. I think my blood sugar was really low, so um, yeah. But let's put these all in here. Let's have these first. I'm drinking juice. Let's start with these. Everything finally. But yeah, I'm really like, I hated this by the way. I'm really grateful that I got the bigger binder. I did not know there were bigger binders than the one I had in Finland, but there was. So super happy about that because now I think this won't get like. It won't break as easily. I could be wrong, but since it's like bigger, since it's like bigger, I, I can fit more in here anyways. So I don't have to worry about that because it was kind of getting a little bit dicey already. So yeah, we do have quite a lot of cards to put away since the last time. So yeah, because I did the in search of. Um, WJSM post. I found a lot of the cards I wanted, so let's just put these away as well. But like here, guess why not? Um, we have the one secret Luda, I think. Do we have one right here? It's this one. Like so. Oh, it's the that's the lock version and this is the key version. So I'll put this here. Like so. Then we have this from WJSM Luda. Right here. Then we can put away and put it here to its place. We don't have anything else with this page, but we do have one. Wait, let me get more sleeves. We need a few more sleeves for this. We have this Ekshi Happy Moment PC. Super happy to finally have this one. We have another extra page completed. Still need these two, but other than that, I have everything for her. Then we have two for the summer Ludas right here. Need to put a sleeve for this one as well. Like so, these are the two we have here today. 
I love for the summer um, cases for everyone except actually. <laughs> but yes, I really like how they look. Like, I love Luda's hair in this comeback. It's just so pretty. So I just love the photo cards in this era a lot. Only one more till we complete that for her. Um, Sola is another issue then. Um, nothing for us you wish. Ignore this page. We do have one Luda for this page. Is this really cute? I love this blue version of Luda so much because the hair on her in this is just super pretty. But yeah, let's put this here. some more Neverland units. I feel like this page has been like so slow. I'm only getting somewhere with that. Nothing for natural selfie pieces. But then we do have no I was lying. We do have this Sola and then this Sugin and Buddha. This one is so cute. I love this piece so much. I love the pink outfit pieces. So, so, so much. We have this. And then this we can put here. Like so. Finally making some progress on this page as well. It's been a slow road. Then we have something that I'm really happy about. We have finally this so a jewel case so now for this page for me to complete my first um ot3 page we only need luda's jewel case and this one is actually i pulled this myself there's it what there was this week there was um this sale on the local k-pop shop that they had minus 50 on everything like not everything but most of their like stuff so they had the sequins jewel cases on sale for like half the price for like 12 euros i know that's still a lot but here everything's so expensive but yeah so it's like the normal price for, for it or whatever so you know but it's, it was cheap uh so i bought it and i got her from her own jewel case from luda's jewel case i got dayong so if anyone wants to trade that for Luda, then please let me know. Take this. Um, then we don't have anything for here. Still missing that one Sola. Why is there not plus cat hair everywhere? Then we have only one sequence unit. It's this Sola and that one one. Super cute. We put it here. like so only missing this one still i have these on the way so hoping that that happens soon <laughs> um two cards for this page actually about to complete a yet another page or almost have everything oh, <laughs> almost have everything for the the black album like so, we have the white version. And then we have the blue one. So only missing the black, which again makes me sad because I had it. I pulled it from the al first album I bought, like pre-ordered. And I have given it away because I wasn't collecting Sola back then. So I, I think I traded it for something of extras. So not a complete waste, but still I would have this complete now if I hadn't. So that is that. 
do we have any units for the black i don't think so no we don't so then the next page is this one we do have two ludas for these pages the chocome ones we have this this is my favorite like if we don't count the ribbon one from the pimp era this one is my favorite like that's so cute that, that's the cutest pc i've ever seen so i'm super happy i got that now somewhere with that too finally happy about that we do have three units four units how many units do we have let me see this one are for the supper yuppers one um, we have this vintage udon subin and then we have this candy udon subin let's put them here this one is the ribbon so we have these two there was a sleeve here was there a sleeve in here too yes there was okay cool and luna selfies for the selfies um units for this one complete no wait is this yeah and then we have these three for the separate uppers units we have luna and supin again luna and supin again and luna and Dayong. like so let's put this here progressing with these units as well so we're happy about that and then lastly but not least we do have photo book stuff because i bought also the film mini book while i was at the local store for that daily whsn one and i also have luda's whole set coming so i didn't need this basically so i will trade that or try to sell it or something for something else but i'm just gonna put these here and actually since we got a whole new page hmm, should i just put this here on another page since there is three cards for i remember uh, for the daily WJSN, so it would make sense. I'll just leave them real quickly. I absolutely adore these pieces. They are so pretty. Like actually one of the prettiest cards I've ever seen. Like all of these. I just love them. I love the vibes. They're so soft. Yeah. So let's just put these at the end. Since the photo book one has two, it has one selfie and then one Polaroid. So let's put those there when I get those. And then let's put these film mini book ones here. 
starting with Sola, Nixi, and then Uta. So, I actually will take these notes out from here and put them in here. We don't, we don't have like, we don't have to put notes here because we know what's gonna go there. And we know in what order, so it doesn't matter. So later we get those. So I don't even have any like placement for these because I'm only collecting like uh pubs I can get my hands on so I'm not really taking like any how do you say this any anxiety anxiety over this so I would just get them if and when I can so I don't have a place for them but then what we are gonna do Still, we're gonna put these. These they came out. I got these heart cards from the film mini book, so I thought we'd put these as well in here. Super cute. I'll just put them at the backs of these for every window. So let's put this here for Ekshi. This here for Buddha. Wait, I need to put them here. Is this the right way? I think so. Okay. And then this one for Sola. Like so. Let's look in here now. Have a look here. And that's it for WGSN. I am so happy with my collection at, as of this moment. Like it's, I, I feel like it's finally getting somewhere. Like I've been stuck on just Ekshi for a really long time, but I'm finally getting more cards. So I'm super happy about that. Still like this cover though. <laughs> That's that. And then we finally come to this massive piece of a collection. So I did the liberty of putting every different thing already here because I got the bigger binder so that I could have Vivas and Solos in a complete like other binder. So I already put these here. I didn't have to do much organizing. I also put the cards I had after in here so that we can just do this. That goes there. And do I have any more other cards for this collection after the last one? I don't think I have. Oh, right. I noticed from the last time that I had miscalculated everything and I had put these with these. So the time for us starts from this and not this so i had everything kind of fucked right there so i changed those but i don't think we really have anything for here what we do need to organize though is the Linus binder so glad to finally have one for them I made... Oh, we do have this one. Where is this? Note. 
now we have that one as well. Sorry for the socks era. Don't have anything. Do we have anything else for you? I don't think we do. Only thing I don't know we don't. Only thing I don't like about these big binders is that they're super hard to like flip these pages because the, these are so big. So that's really hard. But other than that, I really like this. And this is almost full as well. But as we know, G Firm probably, unless they will continue later on. But for now, they have. So. No more new cards coming, so this is just fine for the, this one binder. But let me go get the Vivis one. So, this is the Vivis binder. I put every page here already, and I did the, took the liberty of doing all of these for the pages. But let's just start putting them in. You will see how I've organized it in my mind now with the new comeback and everything so this will be just the vivis binder and solos so i thought putting solos first and then vivis after that would kind of work out well um so first up we have yelling um we have her aria here we will put these in the middle this is not her solo card this is um a pre-order benefit for labyrinth but we will put it here in the middle because she has eight cards on her solo album so i will put that there as a filler until if i get the id one that she has in this album as well then i'll put that in the middle for now we'll do it like this And then we will, of course, expand on this if and when she has her next comeback. You choose comeback was already announced for next month. I don't know if I will be buying, like, pre-ordering the albums because I don't have <laughs> that much money at the moment because I'm thinking of moving apartments and such. But if I can't buy it now, I will definitely buy it later. I still don't even have her rec album, um, so that's kind of sad. Let's start putting these in. She had so many cards on her solo album, the first one. I hated that. I was a little bit in shock, actually. Let's just put these here. I have to keep taking breaks because my aunt keeps calling me about the new apartment <laughs> so i had to take like a million breaks she just showed me the apartment and it looks absolutely gorgeous i cannot wait i am one pessimistic um son of a bitch though so i will probably say if i move till i'm actually there because i am afraid to say anything but hopefully i will be able to move but this is, oh my god, the lighting is so bad now. Like, there's zero light. But this is what we have right now. This is their, um, both their solos. This actually is, I hope the new album doesn't have as many cards as the Rick one, went, uh, Rick one has. So hopefully they will fit in this one, because if not, then I will, be, I will have to add more pages. But I will keep those for that comeback. Then we can start putting this in. Since I'm now collecting all of these three, we have a whole new layout for this binder. Um, this is what it will be like uh, now. We had the. I was only collecting Una for the time being, so it looked completely different. But this new layout will look like this. Wait. 
So and then that there, that there, and then these go here. So this goes here. This goes here. Don't have any cards for the first two IRS for Shingbi or Amji. Because I traded everything away because I was only collecting Una at the time. But from now on, I will obviously keep everything I get from albums. Unless I pull dupes. So I have, as you, if you see my unboxing of the various one, you will see that I have some of their cards from there. But that's it for that. Then we start Summer Vibe. I'm kind of annoyed that some of the notes have like a different tone of color, but I ran out of the ones, the pink ones, so I had to use the yellow ones as well. That's what it looks like now. And then we continue. Put these here. This one has the different bag. This one too. This one has the same. Do I have more of the flying point one? I can just put these here. Actually, let me just put these. So, we have this one. these ones
Then we get to the group cards for the era. Um, we have the photo book ones first, I believe. Do I only have two? So let's put these here. Oh, I don't. I was lying to you guys. So, and then we continue with the photo book ones. And then to top this page, because it ends so abruptly, we have those to fill it up. The POVs for Una for that, so that kind of fills the page. So that, that is that for Summer Vibe. And then we move on to the new era, Various. We have various cards for... We have so many cards. I'm kind of... Like, we don't have cards, we have so many sleeves to put in. These are the cards for this first page. We have one Una, one Omji, and one Shimbi. Let's just put that there, because it has a different back than these two. And then put these two here. But I assume they're all from the on and off version, because they are black and yellow, just kind of different. I don't know how all the backs go, but this is just what I'm assuming how they will go. So take this layout with a grain of salt for now. That is the first page. So let's put these in. This is the side A, isn't it? Yeah. Don't have anything else for side A, if I remember correctly. The rest are just the classy one. Alright. Wait. Where am I That's that. Then we get to classy. snow dropping from the roof so my cat is like super excited right now yeah we do have these cards for the classy one we'll just add this there and because this one has a different back i will put this in here in case there's two with the same back or three and i will just change them Is what we will roll with. And then there is still the two, there's the PLVE. So many sets of everything. <laughs> I am going crazy. We have these two, and then, yeah. But let's put actually the set A here. We have this complete first page, first page, first row here. Don't have sleeves for them. That we'll have to do for now. That's the wrong way. Like so. Then we have that set A and that set A. Then we get to this set B. Okay. Um, set 
If you are horrified by the amount of cards I need, imagine how terrorized I am feeling right now. Um, but this was my own decision, so I could have chosen not to collect everything or try to collect everything. So this is on me. Then we have the jewel case. We have one another and nothing else. So let's just put these all in. Like, they are doing way too much. Way too many cards, Paratura. I loved Beam of Prism, because we only had... Like, you could have completed uh, one person, like, with only buying both of the copies once. But these eras, it is not looking good, guys. It's just... It keeps being more... I thought Summer Vibe was the worst, but... The worst was still ahead of me. <laughs> Chokes on me. So they really need to chill with these cards. So they're so pretty, but there's just too many. What I forgot to do was make um, fillers and everything for the good ones. And I don't have any more pages. So even if I wanted to, I couldn't. So I will just put these cards here and we will get to that part some other time. This is everything I actually had with this. Let's do a flip through of what it looks like right now. So this is the solo plus Vivis al album. <laughs> the binder. Here's Yerin and here's Yuichu solo stuff. Then we get to Vivis, Beam of Prism. And Summer Vibe starts. Summer Vibe ends. Various starts. Look at how many cards there is. Absolutely horrifying. And that is that for them. And then we have the um, season screenings, figure inclusions. I don't have Una here because I don't know why actually. And then I really need to find a better placement for those. Um, but yeah. That is it for this one. And that's actually every binder I had. Really hope you enjoyed this. And let me know if you want to see me organize, uh, reorganize stuff more in the future as well. I have never done one. So if this was um, not, to, uh, not to par what you've watched before, then I'm sorry. And I will definitely try to do, try to do better in the future. But I really like doing this and... I really like chatting with you guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed this as well. Um, I will see you next time. Bye bye!